said hello to. Welcome to Kid Life. All right, Scruff, you ready to pray for the day? All right, you gotta bow your head and close your eyes. I'll help you. There you go. There you go. Just cover up your eyes there. Okay. All right, now bow your head. All right, let's pray. Father, we thank you for today. I thank you for all my friends that have joined with us. I pray that you let them have an awesome day, God, that you let them learn something new about you, open up their ears, open up their hearts, and open up their minds to whatever you have for them today, God. We thank you so much for what you're going to do and all that you've already done. In your name we pray, amen. Now, let's get warmed up with our hands just for fun. You know, God is fun. He's the most fun. Here we go. It's a little thing I call open shut them. You might have heard about it, but I'm going to try to catch you. Here we go. Open shut. Open shut. Give a little clap. Open shut. Put them in your lap. Make them spiders. Creepy crawl them. <laughs> Crawl them right up to your <laughs> chin. Open up your great big mouth. Ah, but do not let them in. Oh, bitch up. Oh, bitch up. <laughs> Give a little clap. Oh, bitch up. Put them in your lap. And now it's time to get out my friend, Vern the bird. Let me get on my glove. Vern, come get on my arm. Yes, Nan. Hi. Hello. Hi, kids. Hi, Vern. <laughs> you guys got any worms? I'm hungry. Can you feed Vern some worms from him? Thank you. <laughs> Don't do it. Thank you. Now, Vern, it's time to find out what's in the mystery box. It's a worm. Vern, we don't ever know what's in there, but it's always fun to see. Let's take a look. Ready? Oh, boy. I want to see. There's nothing in there. Now it's time to sing the mystery box song. Can you say hit it? Hit it. Get out your mystery hands. Here we go. Mystery box. Mystery box. Wonder what's inside. Mystery box, mystery box, wonder what we'll find. You know what we're going to do. Read a clue, take a guess, we'll find out what it is. You sing it, Vern. Mystery box. Good. Mystery box. Wonder what's inside. It's a worm. <laughs> You're so silly, Vern. Now, Vern, it's time for you to read the clue. <coughs> Okay, go ahead. Warm up your reading voice. Whoa. All right, Vern, let's read the clue. There's something in the mystery box you use to make music. There's something in the mystery box you use to make music. What do you think it is? Good guess. Vern, I already know what you think it is. It's a worm! <laughs> Let's take a look and see. <gasps> Ooh. Not a worm. Well, <gasps> it's a tambourine, Vern. That's because today, Vern, we're going to talk about worship. And using instruments and our voices, that's one way we can worship God. And you know, today we actually celebrate Palm Sunday. 
What's that? Palm Sunday burn is the week before Easter. See, on Palm Sunday, Jesus rode on a donkey into Jerusalem, and the people laid the palm branches down in worship for him to walk over. And then they sang Hosanna, which meant save us. Oh, cool. But Vern, that's just one way of worship. You know, as we talked about, there's many ways to worship God. And the best way to worship God is with our whole life. That means everything we do, we do it for God. But what if I don't feel like worshiping? I mean, all this crazy stuff going around with the coconut virus? You, you mean the coronavirus? I uh -huh, that. And what if my dad doesn't go back to work? And what if I can't find any more worms? Who cares about the toilet paper? I better go stock up on worms. Burn, burn, burn. <laughs> Listen, I understand. I understand things are a little crazy right now. But remember, the answer to all the what if questions is God will take care of me. And burn, the two best things you can do when you have problems is pray and worship. <laughs> Remember we talked about it gets our eyes off the problem and on God, the problem solver, and it's even like a type of warfare, a battle. God says that he will keep us in perfect peace when we keep our eyes on him. But what if I don't feel like worshiping? Well, Vern, you don't have to feel like worshiping to worship. You just do it. The same way you might not feel like taking medicine, but you take it because it's good for you. We were made to worship God. So, just do it. You will be glad you did. I, I understand, and I'm gonna worship! Well, that's awesome, Vern. I'm glad you're gonna worship. Let me get this, huh? I'm gonna worship right now! Well, that's great, Vern. You can worship in your box as we go on to the next thing. I like to worship with you! Agree to hallelujah! Okay, Vern. <laughs> I love that song. I raise a hallelujah. Okay, Vern. Okay, it's time to go. You can keep worshiping in there. Bye. Can you guys say bye to Vern? Bye. I raise a hallelujah. Hosanna. Okay. Bye. Okay, Vern. We love you. Bye. Okay, see you later. Love you. All right, boys and girls. It's time to stand up and get ready for worship. Here's a song that we can sing about not letting the rocks praise Jesus. We are gonna praise Jesus. Now I want you to get out your air guitar. It's behind your ear. Take it out. Put it on. Because you're gonna need to play it some during the song, okay? Now say, hit it, Mr. David.
name. We love you, Jesus. Worship you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. And now, let's tell Jesus that we love him. You know, this is the sign language for Jesus, pointing in your hands like that, like there's nails in your hands. We're going to sing one of my favorite songs, Jesus, We Love You, by Mr. Darson. It goes like this. Try to sing along with me. Jesus, we love you. Jesus, we love you. Oh, Jesus, we love you. Jesus, we love you. Let's sing it again. Jesus, we love you. Jesus, we love you. Oh, Jesus, we love you. Jesus, we love you. Can you blow Jesus some kisses with me? We love you, Jesus. Thank you for being with us. Thank you for holding us. Hi, this is my friend, Grandpa. Hey, are you out there in TV land? <laughs> And he wanted to tell the Bible story today. Yep, I do. All right, Grandpa, go ahead. Remember, all the stories in the Bible are true. Well, this is an awesome Bible story. <sighs> oh, Grandpa, wake up. Oh, sorry, but I forgot to tell you. My friend Grandpa, he gets a little tired because he's older and we just have to help wake him up. Right, Grandpa? That's right. All right, go ahead, back to the Bible story. This is an awesome Bible story, and... Oh, Grandpa. Wake up, Grandpa. Woo! Sorry. Woo, that's all right. I'm good. Ah, uh, yes, you are, Grandpa. Go ahead, tell us the Bible story. This is one of my favorite stories in the Bible. Grandpa, wake up. Oh, sorry. That's okay, Grandpa. Then you do an exercise. Oh, okay. Go ahead and do an exercise. <clears throat> Touch my toes. Now I'm ready. Oh, I'm glad you're ready. Okay. All right. Tell us. What is the Bible story this week? <sighs> <laughs> That's Grandpa. <laughs> Wake up. Yeah, I think I need a nap. That's okay, Grandpa. You go take a nap. We'll let the video tell the Bible story this week. Can you guys say bye to Grandpa? Bye. Bye. It was Passover time. Jerusalem was filled with people. When Jesus reached the Mount of Olives, a hill overlooking Jerusalem, he told two of his disciples to find a donkey. They found the donkey and put their cloaks on it. Jesus rode on the donkey, fulfilling the Bible verse that says, Here comes your king, Jerusalem, riding on a donkey. Jesus rode the donkey down to Jerusalem. Many people remembered his miracles and joined him. They put cloaks and palm branches on the road before him to honor him. They hoped that Jesus was God's promised Savior. So they shouted, Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is the King of Israel. The whole world is following him, the Pharisees grumbled. Tell them to be quiet, Jesus. Even if everyone stopped shouting, Jesus replied, the stones would still praise me. <laughs> Come in. Hi, Emily. Hi, Guy. I have a question for you. How can you worship God? I give God all of me. <laughs> Yowza palooza! That's the answer. God is so amazing and I love him so much. <laughs> me too. But how do I give God all of me? One way is by clapping or raising your hands to him in worship. <laughs> I think I have a picture pass about that. Friends, 
Which picture pass helps you say hello to a friend? Super job, friends! It's the waving hands! <laughs> waving our hands to God shows that we want to be close to Him. It's like giving Him a big hug. <laughs> I saw a Bible story about that. When Jesus went to Jerusalem, people waved their hands and palm branches. Those people worshiped God with great joy. They wanted to show Jesus he was their king. <laughs> I want to do that too. I want to worship Jesus with joy. Do you know a Bible verse about that? Sure do. <laughs> Friends, wiggle your ears if you're ready to learn a verse with me. I'm wiggling my ears. Are you wiggling yours? Okay, listen to what the Bible says. Psalm 102. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him singing with joy. La, la, la. <laughs> Friends, say the verse with me. Psalm 102. Psalm 102. Worship the Lord with gladness. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him. Come before him. Singing with joy. La, la, la. Singing with joy. La, la, la. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, friends. Now say the whole verse with us. Psalm 102. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him. Singing with joy. La, la, la. <laughs> friends, you got it. <laughs> Thanks so much. Bye, Guy. Bye, Emily. Bye, friends. Come on. <laughs> Worship. <laughs> do, 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 do. La, 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 la. Oi. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Oh, oh man. Oh. Hey, Blinky. <laughs> what you doing? Hello, Shine. <laughs> Blinky is having a bad day. I was playing with my new pinwheel, but it broke. And now all I have is this stick. I'm sorry, Blinky. It's no fun when something breaks. Oh, this is a really bad day, and there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> well, you could worship. Huh? Why would I do that? Worshiping God is for when you're happy. Besides, we're not even in church. Friends, do we need to be at church to worship God? That's right. We don't have to be in a church. We can worship God anytime, anywhere. And Jesus said, if you don't worship, the rocks will. That's me. <laughs> so, Blinky, what do you say? Are you ready to worship? <laughs> Guess I'd better start warming up my voice. It can get kind of gravelly. La, uh, la, la, there it is. When we worship, we think about how good God is, and that will make any day better. <gasps> You're right, Shine. God is good. I'm not going to let a broken pinwheel keep me from worshiping him. Dear God, I want to worship you no matter how I feel, because you are good. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, Shine, no more using my voice for complaining. I'm going to use it to worship God instead. <laughs> That's great. Let's all worship. Count me in. Friends, let's rock. You are awesome, that's why I praise you, Lord. <laughs> we <laughs> Shine, you're a great pinwheel and a super -de duper friend, too. From the ground to the sky, rocking side to side. I praise you because you're awesome. I praise you because you're awesome. This is my friend Ellie. Hi! 
Ella, you have a Bible scripture you want to share with us? I sure do. It's on 150, verse 6 says, Everything. Everything? That has breath, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. So everything, everything that's alive, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I love that. Everything that, everything that, everything that, Praise the Lord. I love that. Everything that has breath, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Psalm 150, verse 6. Yep. And remember. Remember what? The Bible is like water for your soul. It sure is. Can I? Hey, I think they want the water this time. Watch out. Here it comes. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Exciting news! We want you guys to draw us a picture. We're asking all of our friends to send us pictures of saying thank you to our essential workers, such as doctors, nurses, police officers, and firemen, and other essential workers that are working during this hard time. So, draw us a picture, show mom and dad, and then have them send a picture of it to this email address right here. And for everyone that sends in a picture, we're going to send you guys a song that you can download and listen at home. So, all you have to do is just send us pictures and we're going to show them next week on our next video. It's so exciting. We can't wait to see what you guys are going to send us. Goodbye. See you next time. Thank you.